So for getting drunk, back again with yet another attempt of a Sidewalk review. Sidewalk we're going to review just now is another Bullmore's one from the Bullmore stable. And it is Wild Blueberry in line. 4% of Richter skill. This is one I have never tried before. Uh, got this, uh, Mrs. So fucking drunk picked this one up for me. And I am a big fan of blueberries. And I like my lime. Uh, as well, although it doesn't like me because of the indigestion, but I do like the taste of lime. So anyway, it's 4% of the right to skill for this one. So let's get it in the glass and see what it's all about. There we go. Hefty dark pour. What we expected. Oh, this. Can't see any carbonation going through there. Boom! What in God's name is that? Yeah, it's blueberries. My God, that is blueberry heaven. I love blueberries. Many, many years ago, I think it was in the 90s, I went to USA and I had blueberry muffins. We, we couldn't get them in uh, Scotland at the time and I just fell in love with blueberry muffins. And because it, Scotland's one of the most unhealthiest places in the planet, we didn't have that much fruit and blueberries. I, I don't think we even knew they existed. Uh, but I do eat fresh blueberries as well. That's all you're getting from that. It's like smack of blueberries. Nothing else in there. It's, it's just a case of diving into Batch 24 here in Boomer's. Blueberries and lime, slangy van. Mm. Oh, blueberries, blackberry, but it's, it's like blackcurrant is in there as well. The only way to describe this is. Like, I'm an old, I'm an old campaigner here and I can remember uh, being a kid and being daft and going into the kitchen and drinking diluting juice, you know the stuff you, you have to put your water in and drinking the blackcurrant, it was always blackcurrant, it was Ribena my mother used to buy and that's what that tastes like. It tastes like a, a heavy smack if you just try to concentrate on itself and you get this big smack of black currant. Uh, but there is a little bit of a hint of blueberry in there as well. And when it all goes down, you're getting the lime on the aftertaste. It's actually not that bad. But I've just reviewed another one of Bill Wars and it was the Zesty the Blood Orange and that was more palatable than this one. Don't get me wrong, it's, it's actually okay for 4%. Mm. Mm. But it's got that, it's got that black cunt uh, cordial, not that way. There's, maybe you don't, I, I'm old, I'm old, believe me, I am old, and you've got that sort of uh, velvet tongue with black cunt, I don't get that with blueberries at all, I've tried blueberry juice, I've tried blueberry in different forms, I'm not getting that at all, but <laughs> the black cunt, there's a lot of black cunt in there as well, but don't get me wrong, it's it is actually quite nice. Is it one I'll drink again? Yes, I probably would. Because uh, I've got one in the fridge. Uh, yeah, it would be one I would drink again, believe it or not. Under the right circumstances. It's, it's, it's heavy cider. This is, to me, is quite a, a heavy cider. Uh, so anyway, 
Patch 24, the boom wheels, and the lane. Well, what is it? Well, blueberries. Is there such a thing? Uh, well, blueberries and lime. 4% of the rates of skill. Oh, am I going to give us? I'm going to give us a sofa cane drunk. I'm going to give us a 3.5 out of 5. It is one I will drink again, believe it or not. It's. It's one, it's like, uh, it's. I don't know how to describe it to you. You'd have to really have a go at it yourself. Uh, I've had a. Believe it or not, I've reviewed a few sizes tonight and it's. It is. It's, it's quite thick, it's quite gloopy, it's got that in its uh, metal. Maybe in another time when it might be my first side, I might really enjoy it, but. And give it a higher grade, but. Well, whatever. If you've had Boomers, <laughs> what's it called? What do they say, lad? Well, blueberry and lime. If you've had it, give us a shout. So if we came drunk, we'll salute you if you stay to the end of this video. And if not, hopefully I'll catch you in another beer review. That'd be wrong, wouldn't it? A bit of cider review. Stan Jiva, keep drinking the good cider. We catch you in another one. Check for that.